time is it? It's peanut butter jelly time. Y'all are tired of me now, ain't you? Y'all are tired of me now. <laughs> but I got a review. It's time for a show review. Show review time. That's what time it is. Because this weekend, I binged on some love, death, and robots on Netflix. It's on Netflix. Now, I say binge, but it is a quick one to binge. If y'all, because each, number one, each episode is like the longest one was like 15 or 16 minutes. The, like they're not long. I think there is like 13 of them. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm off on that. Maybe there's more. Maybe there's more. Maybe 18, 15, 18, maybe around there. But number one, like the, and some of them are real short. So they'll go from like even six minutes each episode ranging from six minutes the least amount to like 15 16 minutes like the longest ones so they're real short easy to watch and every episode is different like totally different totally different characters totally different story like all every episode is different they all are animation except one they did have one that wasn't animation although they had animated stuff in it but like the characters it was that guy from uh What's his name? Topher Grace from that 70s show. So he was like the main one. He was like the guy in it and he wasn't animated. But then they even had some that was totally CGI that you know who the character are. Like you remember that girl? She was in Orange is the New Black. Black girl. She died. Um, She was kind of little. I think she was even bald in that. Oh, what is it? I wish I could remember her name. But she was in one and I was like, that's her. But it was totally like CGI her. You know, so and then e even and I say everyone's like CGI animated, but even the animation styles on everyone is different. Like some of them look like more that realistic CGI ish animation and some are totally like just animation animation. And they're crazy. That's what I like. Y'all know I like weird crazy stuff. And this is I mean, it tells in the name love death of robots. Like each episode either has love, death, or robots, or some of both, or some of all, <laughs> you know? Like they had this one called the yogurt, yogurt something, and it was about how yogurts like take over the world. <laughs> how, the, how yogurt, what you eat, takes over the world. My favorite one though was the first one. That's what drew me in. It kind of, maybe too, because I just saw like Alita, Battle Angel, not long ago. And it kind of reminded me of that because like it's this girl and she controls like these like it, and it's like robot fights. So they're like these auto you, you saw like that Autobot fight where they get two robots in the ring and they start fighting each other. Right. It's like that. But each robot is controlled by like a person in their brain. Like they have something in their brain that controls and they're just sitting there like this and they're controlling the robots that are fighting. And these robots, I never seen robots like this. I mean, these robots bleed. And it was the first one was about the girl is like a master, like robot person, like robot fighter. And she comes up with this guy and he's, oh, he's dirty too. He's calling names at FN. Blah, blah, blah. But that was a cool one. And the ending even had a twist. But that's what I'm saying. That was one of my favorites. But every episode is different. And some I didn't like too much. I was just like, eh, you know what, too? I was kind of like turned off, like I was judgy. Like if there, I was like, oh, this is this animation style, not my favorite. So I'm like, I didn't like it much. <laughs> I was judgy like that because with, with animation, y'all, like I'm picky. I am, I'm picky with that kind of stuff. Like I like, you know, because my husband like, you know, you like animated stuff. I'm like, yeah, I like like, you know, animation, like the cartoons and nice animation, you know, Disney type animation. But when it when animation is like more realistic, I like it to be more the CGI realistic animation. And if they got fighting and that kind of stuff, I like it to look like more of the Alita Battle Angel when they're like that. If it if it's the fighting, it looks cartoonish. Like I, I can't get into it as much. But it's not always fighting. Like they have some crazy stuff <laughs> in some of these. They have they had this one where this guy lives in. <laughs> lives in the dump I think it was called like Mr. Dump and this guy tries to come in talking about you got to move we're building this and that here and he's like oh let me tell you a story and it turns out I don't want to give stuff away I don't want to spoil it for y'all y'all but 
it turns into some craziness. But anyway, I think it's something y'all should check out. I think it's something y'all would like. I liked it. I like, that's why I said every episode was different. So there were some episodes I was like, this is dumb. I didn't like it. I didn't like this. But I liked way more episodes than I disliked. And it's short. That's why I said each episode is different. They're short, easy to watch, easy to plow through real quick. And it's something different. I like something different. So I suggest it. I suggest it on Netflix. Love Wait, what is it? Love, Death, and Robots. I almost forgot it. Love, Death, and Robots. Check it out. Bye, y'all. Oh, subscribe. And thumbs up or down. And notifications.